Hello, everyone. Uh, my name is Yuan from the Computer Science Department at Vanderbilt University. Uh, today, I'm extremely happy presenting our work on large graph-based session recommendation with session adaptive propagation. And this work is jointly collaborated with people from the Home Depot when I did the internship there. In many online e-commerce platform, uh, the users would sequentially navigate among different items and finally make the pictures on the next item. And the information that we can use to make the prediction on what potential item this user uh, might like uh, is this historical interactions between this user and items. For example, cornerstone, a lawn mover, and a flower. However, in addition to this uh, in-context information, we can also use the relational information derived from the knowledge graph. You can see because the cornerstone and the lopper, they are frequently pictures together for decorating the garden. So there might be some strong relation between these two items. And hence, we can use this relational information derived from the knowledge graph to augment whatever items we encounter in the sequence generated by the user. And the key idea to uh, leverage the relational information from the graph is to identify relevant neighbors from knowledge graph based on the sequence context or session context. On the top row, because you can see this user is to decorate his garden. So among the neighbors, five neighbors of this flower, we try to leverage more information uh, that are relevant to garden, which are lopper, water king, and axe. However, if you look at the sequence at your bottom side, uh, this user is trying to decorate the kitchen. So instead of using the uh, garden related items, we try to use more kitchen style items, which are table and sink. So based on this, we propose our framework and more results are put in the paper. If you're interested, feel free to check it out. And uh, before ending my slide, I want to express my sincere appreciation for all my lab mates. And also this work is supported by the gift funding from the Home Depot and National Science Foundation. And with all that, if you have any questions or interest in this work, feel free to contact me by scanning this QR code and uh, welcome any discussion uh, later offline. Thank you.